Welcome to Awesome Code. Please subscribe to my channel and like my video. In this video, we will write a C program on Linux to extract file information, including the in node number, the file size, and the number of links. It will input the file name from the user. The file name is just a link to an in node, and that in node in turn contains information about where on the file system the actual data is. And in node also contains metadata such as the creation date, date of loss, modification, total size, file size, owner, and access rights, and more. We will extract this metadata using the stat command uh, in our C program. So first I'm going to include the headers for our program. Stat.h from sys and uh, types.h from sys. Uni std.h. Include error number dot h and string dot h. function int argc char pointer arg v array and then we will have a structure of stat type file stat and we will have a if condition to check for the argc to check the number of argument passed to our program so if arg c not equals to two then we are going to print the error the usage for this program so we are going to print f print f to standard error usage file we will tell user to input the file name And our we at index zero will print the name of our program file underscore stat and we will return one
So this will happen if the user uh, did not enter the file name when uh, running this program from a command line. And now we are going to call the stat uh, command or function. We will also implement error handling, handling in this program. The stat function will be wrapped in an if statement. So we need a stat. First, we are going to surround it with the if statement. Then we will have a stat pass in our v1 at index one element. That will be the file name on which we are going to run the stat command and file stat structure to read the information from a stat command to a structure. And we are going to check the return value with the minus one. And if there is some error, we will print an error message to standard error for the file name and the error message from the error number. The program will also return the error number variable to the shell. So in now our if, we are going to print the error message. If the stat uh, function's return value is minus one, then we are going to print the message cannot read file. We are going to use fprintf. Passing standard error. Cannot read file and to print the file name and the error and the new line after that this is for the file name and print the error by passing in error number and we are also going to return uh, error number so we need a return If uh, everything went well, then we are going to print uh, uh, the information about the file. The fields we are going to use are uh, stat inno for the in node number, that is st inno. So let me print it. This would be. Print 
path in node while stat dot st inno for the in node then we are going to print the file size print f While stat as the size and now we are going to print the field for st and links for the number of links to the file print f and here we are going to print all links This is n links and is missing. Don't need extra s link. So I will uh, run a GCC command inside this right here where I have this my code file. So I will use GCC and the program name file stat dot c a dash o option to create the object file and that will be file stat and just hit enter and our program is compiled now we can run our program file stat without any arguments so we get the message how to use this program and provide the file with our program file name so over here i'm going to list uh, uh, using the ls command uh, the content of our directory and i'm going to pick any file such as system info and pass into our program file stat to get the file stat on this file so run our program file stat and now i'm going to pass in the file name system info dot c and hit enter and we get that in node number file size and length to this file to keep on learning please subscribe to my channel awesome code like my video keep supporting me and thank you for watching